Hello and welcome to this video provided by Fudge Learn on Oracle eBusiness Suite. I'm going to be talking specifically about general ledger changes available in release 12.2. The key change is around general ledger approvals and the new integration with the approvals management engine or AME. This integration is available from both release 12.2 and has also been backported to version 12.1.3. This means that there are two separate patches available dependent on which release you are on. The integration enables greater flexibility but also greater complexity of approval hierarchies. Approval rules can be defined for different scenarios, say for example combinations of ledger, entered amount or approval level. In addition to this, journal attributes such as use category, account or even descriptive flex field information can also be used. There's another big benefit which is that journal approvals can be actioned in parallel. This means that say around period close when you've got high volumes of journals being created these can be approved much quicker. In version 12.2.4, there are two new GL capabilities. Firstly, there's the extension of restrictions for creating manual journals via Web ADI for third party control accounts. Third party control accounts are general ledger accounts posted to by sub ledger applications. So, for example, Oracle payables or receivables. So you wouldn't normally expect to have manual journals posting to them in any case. Also at this version, there is the ability to use a single mass allocation formula to produce allocation journals for all ledgers within a ledger set. If you'd like more information or have any specific questions about release 12.2 changes, then please do go to our website. You can use this QR code, which will take you straight there. We'll also be providing further information and videos on Oracle products impacted by release 12.2. So don't forget to click on subscribe and then on the bell in YouTube to receive updates when we make further videos available. You can also add comments and we'd love to hear your thoughts. Finally, here are some sources of further information.